Good morning. We are in Christmas season. And one of the things that's so characteristic about this is that we get overly busy, that we get over, our schedules are overly full. We lose connection with God, who this is supposed to be all about. And what ends up happening is we end up running dry. And then we also, we, we finally, we get to the end of the holidays and we feel like we need to go back to work to get some balance again. I want to suggest to you that the Lord's Prayer is part of the antidote, part of God's antidote to us. And I want to suggest to you this morning that you would take the Lord's Prayer and you would not only just pray it every day, but maybe you pray it several times a day and that you would pray it very slowly. The um, <clears throat> Years ago, a guy named Larry Lee wrote a book called Could You Not Tarry With Me One Hour? And he basically sensed that the Lord had spoken to him about taking the Lord's Prayer and praying it for an hour. And he's like, how do you pray that for an hour? And basically the Lord spoke to him and said, you say it really slowly. But here's what I'm suggesting, is that you take the time in the morning and that you you pray a phrase of the Lord's Prayer and then you pause, take a couple of breaths, a deep breaths, and then you pray the next phrase and you take a couple of deep breaths and the next phrase. There are six phrases. And as you do that, that you are creating a different sort of rhythm and that and I'm, I'm, I want to suggest to you that in each one of these things that you attach yourself to the Lord in a direct in a direct and conscious and intentional way, that with each phrase that you are looking to attach yourself, it's almost like you're hugging him with every phrase and with every uh, with every pause. And so you would say, Father in heaven. Hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come. Your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. And you you continue in that route. And as you do, you are bringing yourself into the rhythm of the kingdom of heaven rather than the rhythm of Christmas, the rhythm of earth, the rhythm of this world. And you are sinking yourself to the kingdom and to the king of that kingdom. Let's do that and let's practice that in these next two weeks, these next three weeks of Christmas and New Year's and see what God will do. Thanks for joining me today. God bless you.